Hello there, fairies and fawns, satyrs and pokies, and fey folk of all sorts. Today, I'm going to show you how I turned this into a set for ancient library themed photos. First of all, I had to gather my ensemble, a witchy hat with quill feathers to write with, a velvet cape, and a per una skirt from England that I love so much, along with my sturdy, tall boots. Then I had to gather props. This astrolabe was borrowed from a friend. Thank you, Lee. And I love my Griffin candle holder. I've had him for 20 years. Of course, I had a stack of old books. With a little bit of elbow grease and some hard work, I transformed this plain room into an enchanted library. I wanted to share a few poses that I went through. The book that I'm holding is one that I commissioned from an artist in Poland. It's absolutely gorgeous. I love it so much. And I have a set of fairy lights that I'm holding inside the book so that the book seems to glow. Sometimes it's easier to pose in video and then just take screen caps of the video instead of having to hold the remote and click it. And now I'm going to show you how I did a special shot. I held the book as low to the bottom as I could and posed. And then I took a separate photo of me holding my hands as if I was doing a magic spell. The result, when I combined the two together, was this photo of me levitating a book. Close up of a few of the items. Again, the Griffin candle lamp with his eyes glowing. A few potions, some in their box, some outside. This heavy iron candelabra. I covered up a few modern looking books with that unicorn tapestry. Of course, I have to have a goblet and this wonderful candle that inspired it all from Firelight Fables Ancient Library, some quills to write with, and some more ingredients in apothecary jars. I hope you enjoyed this behind-the-scenes look at one of my photo shoots.